there is everything in the government's um, favour if it didn't happen to say it didn't happen. It happened. So the question is, why did it happen? How squalid are we becoming in order to stop every boat? And what happens now? I mean, if only we were a people smuggler, I'd gather a group of people together, steam out into the Indian Ocean, steam around for a while until the Australians heard about it, collect me money and take them back again. It'd be a fabulous trade. So, so David says it happened. Do we know exactly, though, what it is? If we actually do get the um, AG's review, we'll get down to all of those facts. I think, though, if you're a reasonable person in the street, you have the Foreign Minister and Petty Dutton last week just shooting from the hip saying, no, it didn't happen. You've got various people saying, well, if it did happen, it, you know, it happened for the right reasons. You've now got everybody being incredibly non-committal. I suppose one of the things that jars with me is that the reason that we were stopping the boats was to break the business model of the people smugglers. Well, I mean, they're saying the boats have stopped, but clearly these boats hadn't stopped, you know. These boats were out in the water, so it's still, it's still going on. I, I think what alarmed me most, though, was Abbott using the language of we're going to stop the boats by hook or by crook. Uh, we do what we have to do. And we're going to put people's lives at risk to do it. Where principle is principle be blowed, basically, as far as I can see. But if see. the objective is to stop people taking a hazardous journey and dying in the process, the government's rationale is we are saving thousands of lives by stopping the boats. Of course, we're going to potentially try new and innovative things. Maybe even buying back boats. We the, took that to the last the election. The hypocrisy is extraordinary, though, in, in that it, the rationale, the, the language of actually saying no, no to people smuggling, was used in the in, in the whole development of the policy that's uh, brought us to this position. So, I, I mean, I, I can't see why, why, why that really works as a, as a kind of just uh, way of operating this, this, this uh, system, this, uh, this supposed Operation Sovereign Borders.